Hello YouTube. This tutorial will show you how to make your flash animations look around. It will add to your detail and make your videos a whole lot better. And your videos could end up looking like this. Or a lot better. I made the background move so it's not like there's just a big hole in the background but the face is actually sitting on top of everything and if you apply this concept to the words then your words could look a lot better and look like this so first of all you're going to want to start a new flash document and then create a circle oh whoops let's make it a circle you can actually see but create a circle doesn't matter what colors on the inside or the outside just make sure you can see it then you're going to want to highlight it and right click and convert to symbol make sure it's a moving clip movie clip then push OK double click on the circle and then make a whole new layer drag it under the layer one and right click layer one and go down to mask and click that and then you're gonna wanna go to about frame 60 oh and notice that this is 12 fr frames per second that is low quality so I like to go and change it to about 30 that'll make your videos look a lot smoother and just make it look a lot better so first of all so now that you have your circle and you unlocked it you're gonna wanna start with layer 2 and this is making your face so pick a color that you want your stick figure to be I like blue cuz it's my favorite color and then just make the whole background blue then you're going to want to do your eyes and just work on your face and this button right here makes the circle just hide but it's still there and what I'm doing right now is copying the outline so that I get two identical eyes and then just fill it in with white and then now to make the mouth you can change the size of the lines so the mouth looks a lot better let's make it smile okay, and if you want the eyes to move separately than the face you're gonna wanna start a whole new layer change the line back to one and just make the little pupil then if you want two identical ones control copy or control C and control V and then move that into the center of the eye and then you can now you have to create motion tween on both 3 and 2 by right clicking and selecting create motion tween last two have to be part of the frame so make sure it's an arrow all the way and down to a circle now you're gonna wanna move the faces so at just frame 30 push F6 on both of them and then move the face wherever you want it I'll choose to the left and they can even be outside the circle during that time and make sure and then put the pupils so they're actually looking to the left and it makes it look better 
then that's going to be what the face is going to do. Then all you have to do is click on scene 1 and make it 60 frames long or however long your video is. But when you try to watch it just on your screen, it won't work. But you have to push control enter to test your movie and it'll look like your face is moving. And that's about it. Bye.